welcome to the Daily 19. Today is day 19 of a series of 19 workouts to keep you moving during lockdown. And because it's the final one, I'm going to wear my gold Mexican jacket. Let's get moving. So let's start with a little jog. All right, let's try and increase the pace. If you need to, remember you can always do the march. Okay, let's speed it up a little bit more. Right, into jumping jacks. So we're here. If you need to, step out. If you can, take it to the jacks. And bigger arms. So we're just going to be doing one round today. So we've got 16 different exercises. One round, then we're done. All right, let's start with some rotation. Everything we're doing, we have done before already. All right, now let's just loosen up. Squeeze the shoulder blades, relax the shoulders. All right, now let's just bring the legs. Loosen up the hamstrings. First one we're gonna do is a squat with the quarter rep at the bottom. So you can use weight if you've got something to hold. If not, don't worry about it, you can do that body weight. Anyway. So with the squat, we're gonna be here. We're gonna lower, quarter rep at the bottom, and then drive up. If you've got a weight, you can hold it here, dumbbell, kettlebell, book, anything heavy. Right, let's get ready. Feet in position, chest up, three, two, one, let's go. So we go down, little quarter rep, and drive up. Down, quarter rep, and drive. As I say, we'll just do all the exercises just once. Good, pushing the knees out, weight in the heels. All right, it's 20 gone, we're gonna go for a minute. Control the, the knees out. Then drive up. Remember, don't let the knees cave in. Okay, 30 more seconds. All right, good. 20 more seconds. Weight in the heels. Chest up nice and tall. Good, final 10 seconds. Then we're down to the beast hold. Quarter rep. Drive up, let's do one more. And rest, good, all right. Down into all fours into the beast hold. Three, two, one, and lift. And this is your chance to get a minute in. Remember, keep breathing with this. Exaggerate the exhale and pull the abs in. And we're just gonna hang out here. For a minute and then we're going to come on up into a sprint that's going to get pretty hot in this jacket i'm guessing it's getting quite hot already actually seemed like a good idea you know okay 20 more seconds okay final 10 seconds then we're up to a sprint Five seconds, three, two, one, and rest, good, okay. Let's get ready, three, two, one, let's go. So we've got your sprint, if you need to, you can do your march instead. We wanna go as fast as we can, get the heart rate up. After this, we're down onto the floor to prop pumps. I keep driving the arms. All right, halfway. Yeah, keep it going, we've got 20 more seconds. If you need to, just take it down to a jog, but make sure you keep moving. Yeah, if you want low impact, you've got your march. Try and get the knees up high if you're doing your march. 10 more seconds. Then we're down onto the floor to frog pumps. Three, two, one and rest, good. Onto the floor, feet together. If you're using a weight, grab it, put it on your hips. 
and let's go squeeze down so heels are together pushing through the heels driving up with the glutes okay we're gonna do a minute and then we're over onto press ups remember this is the only time we're doing these final ones <laughs> All right, 30 seconds. Speed it up if you can. All right, good. 20 more seconds. Good, 15 seconds. Keep squeezing. Remember the glutes doing all the work here, not your back. 10 more seconds, then we're over to press-ups. Five seconds. Three two, one, and rest. Come on up, over onto press-ups. Okay, ready? And let's go. So if you can, full press-ups. If not, go down, put your knees down, drive up, reset. Control down, knees down, push up. If that's too difficult, just start with your knees down and keep them down. After this, you're on your back and we're going to go into the hollow hold position. Remember with the hollow hold, you can do both feet up or you can do half with one leg up, half with the other. We're going to do 30 seconds each side if you're doing it single legged. Okay, 10 more seconds. Go ahead, one more. All right, over onto your back. Okay, so remember if you can, this position here, if you need to, single side. Ready, and let's go. If you're doing it single side, we'll tell you when to change. If you're doing it both, then we're holding this position here. Remember, really pull the abs down. We're wanting to work the abs here. Okay, 10 more seconds and then we'll change if you're doing it single sided. Three, two, one, change sides. If not, just keep that position. After this, over onto your front, mountain climbers. Okay, 20 more seconds. Good, final 10 seconds. Really pull the abs down into the ground. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Good. Over onto your front. Okay, let's get ready for mountain climbers. Three, two, one, let's go. So we can do these or single, I mean, without the bounce, sorry. So just one leg up, one leg at a time, or put the bit of a jump in if you want to increase it. Remember, you can always do it slower if you need. All right, 10 more seconds. And we're over onto your back to do single leg glute bridges. Three, two, one. All right, over onto your back. So what we're going to do, lift one leg up, you're going to drive with that glue and down. All right, let's go. We'll do 30 seconds on this side, 30 seconds on the other. So this exercise is similar to what we've done uh, when we've elevated your foot on the couch or chair. All right, 10 more seconds. So remember, we're just using that one glue Three, two, one. Change legs, other side. Okay, 20 more seconds. All right, 10 more seconds. Then you're over onto your front. We do prone pull downs to get your upper back working. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, so onto your front. This is where your arms are out. 
we pull down squeeze and then forward okay ready three two one let's go so we're making that w shape all head is pretty much on the floor so pull down and then forward pull down it's getting rather hot here all right 20 more seconds So remember just your upper back, we're not working the lower back here. All right, five seconds. One more. And let's go over into your back. Okay, we've got leg kick outs. So lift the head up if you can, both legs. If not, we do one leg at a time. Okay, ready? And let's go. If you can, do your little jump. As you bring your knees in remember if you need to do single side we can both legs together with a little jump on the way in okay after this we've got burpees that's gonna be a real hop on this jacket remember if you need to single side Okay, 20 more seconds. All right, 10 more seconds. And then we're up to burpees. Okay, five more seconds. And rest, good. All right, up onto your feet. Three, two, one, let's go. So if you can, all the way down, jump in. Jump up if you need to. Step out, step in, reach up. Or if you want somewhere in between, just jump out, in, up, whatever level suits you. But if you can, all the way down, jump in, extra jump at the end. After this, we've got alternating reverse lunges. You can grab some weights if you need to, well, if you want to. Okay, 15 more seconds. 10 more seconds. Let's get one more in if you can. And rest, good, all right. So, with your reverse lunges, if you want to wait, so let's hold up. Grab, grab a weight. Okay, and let's go. So we step back and drive up. Then we change legs and drive up. After this, we just got four more to do. We are nearly through. If you don't have any weight, don't worry about it. Okay, 30 more seconds. After this, we're gonna do a Romanian deadlift. Again, if you've got a weight, a book, anything slightly heavy, then you can uh, use it. If not, still do the movement, but without the weight. All right, five more seconds. One more. And rest good, okay. So with the remaining deadlift, if you've got weights, push it. Uh, keeping it close to your legs, hinging back, stand it up. Ready? And let's go. So if you've got weights, just slide down your legs and then drive up with your glutes. Hinge back, drive up. If you don't have anything, still do it because you'll get a nice stretch on your hamstrings. So a hinge and drive up. Or you can hold a book, anything slightly heavy in front. After this, we're going to go down to side plank. If you can, we do some leg raises. If not, you're just going to stay in that side plank position. We've got 10 more seconds. So hinge, drive up. And let's do one more. And rest, good. All right. 
into your side plank. So we're here. Three, two, one, lift up. Okay, if you can, you're gonna be adding some leg lift. Remember if you need to, we've always got that modified version here. If you can, let's add some leg lifts. Okay, we've got 10 more seconds, so we're spinning around to the other side. Okay, three, two, one. All right, spin it round. Three, two, one, and lift. I don't have any room for leg lifts here, but you get the gist. All right, 20 to go. We're working the obliques here. Okay, final 10 seconds. And then we've got squat jumps or squats. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest good. All right, onto your feet. Ready, and let's go. So if you can, squat jumps. If you don't want the impact, just do fast squats without the jump. So you've got your options. After we've done this, we've got one more beast hold. I thought we should finish strong on an extra beast hold. Remember if you can, we've got the squat jumps in. If you need to, just take it down to a squat instead. Okay, 30 more seconds. All right, 20 more seconds. Nearly through. All right, 10 more seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest, good. All right, down to beast hold. Final bit of work. Ready, and let's go. So we're gonna do a final minute. Remember if you need to come down, have a little rest and then come back up. Big deep breaths. We are nearly through, I promise. Okay, that's halfway, 30 more seconds. And then we're done. Okay, 20 more seconds. So you stick with it. We're nearly at the end. We are nearly there, I promise. Okay, 10 more seconds. Okay, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good. Your work's done, let's stand it up into a quick quad stretch. Oh, hope you enjoyed it. If you have, let me know. Also, if you can, share it with other people so that they can enjoy the Daily 90 as well. Share the love, share the love. All right, change sides. From there, round up, push forward. All right, and then take it behind. All right, over the top, try some extensions. change of the tricep stretch and across just to finish oh. if you want to find out anything more about my personal training or my girls who lift classes both I do online and in real life then uh, just drop me a message all right change sides 
and big shoulder rolls to finish. If you managed all 19 workouts, please do let me know. Definitely write in the comments because it's always good to hear. All right, hope you've enjoyed it. See you soon.